Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to get the lapel choke or the rear naked choke from the back by zipping your opponent's hand up into their own neck, which will force a reaction, giving you the opening you need to get the choke and the finish. Alright guys, let's take a look at the position. So another way to fight hands to get that choke. So if they're defending by grabbing just one side, maybe I have wrist control over here. So he's intentionally just blocked the one spot I need to get my choke. So what I'll do here a lot is if I don't want to work the same grip break I've done in the past where I go thumb in, turn the face. I'll just use this to feed the lapel and I'll try to slide up. Ideally pushing his hand into his neck even more. From here, I'll just start to crank on it like I'm going to finish my choke. It can build a squeeze there and it'll threaten the choke enough to where the person will try to move their hand naturally to create distance. So they'll usually push down against my own hand, which will then allow me to bring my hand in for the choke. So just like we've talked about before, sometimes I can get my thumb in. If, if I start to pull and his hand slides down, I can drop my thumb in and choke. For this one, sometimes though, as I go and they push down aggressively, sometimes it's going one hand or to the rear naked choke is gonna be best. So again, I make him uncomfortable, I open and I slide this up to try to put his hand into his neck as much as possible. I start to choke. When I'm able, I come right over the hand with a thumb in or rear naked choke style. Give that one a try, see what you think. Hey guys, if you liked the video, please subscribe to my channel. Also comment below with any questions, thanks.